Now, NBC5 First Warning Weather with Chief Meteorologist Tom Messner. Well, well it's, <laughs> well, Jinx, that's like four Cokes at this point. No, 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 no There's no, going to no, be no. a six pack on the deck. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> before long. Hey, uh, yeah. the forecast looks pretty good for that uh, graduation tomorrow. I, I was just thinking that as Alice was reading that story, it's going to be fabulous for that. Temperatures going up. And we're going to see a lot of sunshine. Yeah, the timing is really good here. We, we've got a few showers remaining tonight. I mean, this is definitely winding down, so it's going to be a non-issue within the next couple of hours. We are going to clear tonight, and it's going to be frosty for many. It's going to be cold away from Lake Champlain. Yeah. Just uh, watch out if you've got plants and you're nowhere near the lake. It's going to be sunny. It is going to be warmer for tomorrow. There you have it, Middlebury. And the weekend weather forecast coming up right now, I'm thinking looking pretty good. A look at Plattsburgh tonight. Things are fine and dandy. Not much going on. The wind has become nice and calm. It is 56 degrees in the city right now. Meanwhile, 55 Burlington. We've got a 47 Middlebury. We've got 40s and 50s to the east, but look at Saranac Lake already at 37 degrees. It's been clearer over in that part of New York. Here's the thing, as we all clear out, temperatures are going to be going down. And of course, now that the wind has died off for most of us, that's going to make a big difference too. So just get set. As I say, we're going to find some frosty areas away from the lake. All right, weekend is right around the corner. I think all in all, we're in pretty good shape. It's going to be partly sunny each day. The chance for an isolated shower later on Saturday. Certainly most of us won't see that. I think the chance for a few showers later in the day, Sunday and Sunday evening is a little bit higher then say on uh, Saturday, those chances on the rise a little bit. But 70 degrees both days on Saturday and Sunday, so we will take it. All right, let's come on back to tomorrow, and this is just, just a primo day. We're going to see all kinds of sunshine, thinking high temperatures, about 68, 69, pushing 70 degrees in some places. So look at this. We do clear tonight. This is future cast. This is our plan for tomorrow. That is a fine looking day. Tomorrow night, no problems at all. Here comes your Friday. On Friday in the afternoon, there's that chance for an isolated shower too, much like we talked about over the weekend. And actually here it is Saturday. I think all in all, a few more clouds around later in the day could find an isolated shower. Goes like this. Showers coming to an end tonight becomes clear and frosty away from Lake Champlain, at least for some. You're looking at the bigger communities here, but you get into the hinterlands in between. I think for many, it's going to be colder than that. Here's the deal for tomorrow. It's going to be sunny. It is going to be warmer. Lake Placid, 61, 67, Keysville, 68 degrees in Plattsburgh. Same thing temperature wise in Burlington, 68 degrees there. Chelsea, 65. We're looking fine in places like Plymouth, at 64, Bellows Falls 69, Brattleboro up to 68 degrees. Five day forecast, 68 will do it in the Champlain Valley tomorrow to 72 on Friday. Saturday, more clouds around 70 degrees. It, it, the back end of all these days, with the exception of tomorrow, could find a couple of showers around. Just a bit of a better chance on Sunday, 70 degrees, but really most of these days certainly dry. As a matter of fact, look at the 10 day forecast. Temperatures not far from 70 on a lot of those days, and most of those days, sunshine.